don't even know what that means. You can't lose something you don't have. Even if I suck your ass out. Okay. Who this? Howdy, neighbor. Oh my god, good morning! How are y'all doing? Fine. You can you can walk on our property. Yeah, you can come on the property. Hey, slow down! Oh my gosh. Well, you know, I never want to intrude. Never want to intrude. How y'all doing? We're good. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. These tents is way too dark. Nope. Yes. No. I can't see. You can see through the front window. That's irrelevant. I need to be able to look through the side. Well, we, you know, if that's I actually could... a that's actually a point of confusion for a lot of people. Oftentimes, they'll look through the back, uh, thinking, you know, oh, I, I, I could see someone in there, and then the front windshield obviously is intended, but. Um, I would have to see you from the side if I pulled up to you the stoplight. Okay. You do need to be visible. I have this wild theory. But I'm it? never going to go slow enough that you manage to catch up to me to stop me. That, How fast does it go? That was like, you. I don't think you can say that at this point. I don't think you can. Really I fucked up. Give me a sec. I can go pretty fast. I don't want to try. How I'm, fast does it go? I'm not. I, I wouldn't know. Surely. Hypothetically, surely. Uh, hypothetically, we'll go to 20. Oh, you're gone. You're gone. But <laughs> oh. you're also dead in the event where you hit something. So, no, 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 you know. no. This thing is planned. It It just doesn't turn. That's what I'm talking about. And you know what does turn? Locals, Locals. in front of you. <laughs> uh huh. So it ain't worth it. I promise you. 220? Don't. <laughs> Couldn't be me, would doing? never be me. You know, 170 is more my style. 170. That's what it used to go. <laughs> That's what we were at before. Now it's just a piece of crap. <laughs> oh my god. No, it's actually bad. Like, I don't like this. Dude, it's it's sequential now instead of an automatic, and it doesn't slip out. It doesn't drift. It's it's horrible. So boring. Have you it turned off traction control and all that stuff? Yes. Yeah, it does fuck all. Oh no. Well, I am sorry to hear that. Are you though? I'm very sorry to hear that. Are you really? Um, you know, I'm just I'm I'm a I'm a get out there, and have a smile on my face, and just do my job every day as I normally do. Let me ask you this, here, Rhodes. Yeah, ask away. Is your uh, is your speed limiter working? Um. No. Yes and no. Uh, what do you mean yes uh, and ye no? Yes, when I originally enable it, but then I realized um, something happened to where it then disables. It works originally. I don't know if it's the shifting of gears, even in an auto, um, but I did notice that the other day. Yeah. I tried it in the fucking Raiden. Oh, you want to go 90? No, 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 fuck you. <laughs> is the reason any good? It goes, uh, it goes like 190. Yeah, a battery also is gonna eat shit in like 10 seconds. So, what class is it? Really? I don't, I don't fucking know. I think we buy out the Raiden like we were gonna at the beginning. I, I, I want do. to, but I don't want it. Like, literally, head down into the city, unfortunately. Uh, you're good. You're free to go. Uh, so, y'all have a good one. Actually, I have to swing by the house real quick, and then I'm going to the city. Bye bye. No, I don't want it. I don't want it. Hey. Yeah. Going 90 all the time is fucking ass. Yeah, but if we go higher than that, we have to pay more. Yeah, well. Also, the battery thing fucking. Eh. Nope. Oh. Maybe. We'll think about it. I'll go drive it again just to see how I feel. Do you want to you want to keep the car? You're going to bed. What is your plan? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead to the meeting and then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna fucking sleep. Schlep. 
Where are you leaving me for your dumb meeting? Huh? Where are you leaving me for your dumb meeting? Well, I was gonna have a meeting earlier. Why didn't you have it have it earlier? Because I wanted to hang out with you. Yeah, why can't I come to your stupid meeting? No one else brings their friends. Why do you leave me out all the time? It's not how that works. What do you mean that's not how that works? That is not how that works. If everyone else brings their... Because, okay, if that is the case, then I'm just going to say it. People are being disrespectful. If you disrespectful? Don't... Yes. If you just bring people to meetings without running it by people, that's disrespectful if you ask me. Bro, we turn up to all the meetings with people who just turn up with their friends. Like what meetings? Gang meetings? All the meetings. No one ever comes on their own. Well, have you talked to Edda? What about her? Every time we go to our fucking uh, council meeting, people bring people in. It's like, where, why, why are these people at the meeting? They shouldn't even be hey, there. Hey, you've told me. Meeting. You're not bringing anyone because you don't want to be that person. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care about that. Well, that was different from now. Different meeting. Huh? That one's an official one. That one, 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 one. What is the official one? This Saturday night. That's the council meeting. Yeah. That's the big official one of the week. Yes. Do you want to go to the meetings with yeah. Max and Siobhan? Yeah. Okay. I'll I have no them. problem with them. You're the ones that have problems. You're the one that gets all weird with me, not the other way around. I don't really care. Okay, I'll ask then. Oh. <laughs> sure. What do you mean? What, what are you rocking at? Mm -hmm. I don't know why it's a big deal. You don't know why it's a. Uh, Jenny. What? You don't know why it's a big deal. You told me to get over it. Do you want me to get over it, or do you want me to sit here and do you want me to sit here and, and fester on it? Yeah, well, okay, fair. You want to get over it, but then you can't be like surprised that I that I question it. But that's good. Hey, I'm you proud can't of you. say to me, "No, hey, get stop. over it, Jenny," or it's gonna get awkward between us. And then I get over it, and then you're like, "Uh, why are you?" Oh. Why would it get awkward between us? Because that's what you did. You that's like disappeared on my fucking birthday and didn't show up for four days. Okay. That is not what happened, but. Uh huh. Uh huh. No. Then <laughs> that is not what happened. What happened then? I. I'm not. <laughs> not that. Huh? Not that. It had nothing to do with that. Also, I I never said it would be awkward. It's not dad. What? It was not that. Oh, oh my god, you went so f fucking... Oh my god, you went so Scandinavian then. Okay, it's my time to leave. What do you mean? It's my time to... Okay, it wasn't based on that. I just wasn't around. That's 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 all there was to it. Yeah? Yeah, it has nothing to do with the conversation. It has nothing to do with being awkward. He says. I do say that. He says. He is. Alright, I'll be back. I'll ask if uh, it's fine. Huh? You want to go to your meeting to ask if I'm okay to come to your meetings? Okay, I'll call and ask. You don't have to. Don't feel lost. Hey, Michael. Hey. Are you here? Huh? No, not yet. Okay. Jenny wants to come to the meeting, if that's fine. Oh, yeah, that's fine. No problem. Okay. Uh... Yeah, my, my Max went to sleep. Max went to sleep? Yeah, he's fucking. Yeah, you know, what was that you text me when the old man goes to sleep? That is true. <laughs> That's what you said. Yeah, well, he's an old man. All right, uh, five minutes. Okay, cool. See you oh, here. Bye. See you soon. I'm outside smoking, so. Okay. Where? Well, this is your on. fault, by the way. Yeah, I bought packs. This is your fault. I take no responsibility. I'll see you in a bit. Bye bye. All right. Bye. All right. Yeah, get in. Can you grab water first? No. Okay, I'm gonna die. Are you meeting? There's water in the other glove box. Thank you.
What do you mean you take no responsibility? What? I got a yours. I can use them. What do you mean you take no responsibility? That she picked up smoking? You should take responsibility for that. That's your fault. How the fuck is it? What? How is it my fault? Convening your presence means that I smell of I smell of smoke all the time. So does the storage room. So does the car. Everyone around you is just bathed in your smoker's musk. Not my problem. It's your problem when you're the one making the musk. Nope. I don't need to smoke. I just second hand smoke through you. Which is worse. Yeah. Why, so why are you trying to kill me, Michael? I'm going to write on my gravestone. Stone. Stone? Stone. Stone. <laughs> I hate this car with a passion. Not even going to ask what the meeting's about. Also, Max went to bed because he's an old fucking man. Oh, okay. Well, say you. Uh. Okay. Now I'm being told that it would be better if you're not there? Question mark? Huh? I am being told it would be better if you're not there? I don't know. I do not know. What do you want to do? I want to stop you going to your meeting, but that makes me feel weird. Mm, I can ask why. I mean, it's not my business, but that is why I get. That's why I feel weird. Mm, I can ask why. Mm, not my business. Well, uh, it's involving you, so how is not your business? Which I mean, it's, yes, it's no. Mm -mm. Well, okay. Now I'm, I'm just gonna. Can I play Devil's Advocate? What? What if, it, if what if there is something that just you know is not for other people to hear? What does that mean? I don't know. That that I don't know. I don't know what what it would be. I'm just saying. Again, playing Devil's Advocate. But, I mean that's. Mmm, that's not Devil's Advocate. How's it not? Because that's not... That's... Okay, so like... Let me explain this. To say there is something that we... She wants to talk about in terms of like, uh, council stuff. That she doesn't want other people to hear. Again, I don't know. I don't know if that's the case. Right. Mm hmm. But I would assume you talk to me about that stuff anyway, or do you not? No, I will. But she doesn't know that. Right, but that's like asking, like, it's not the same because obviously they're married, but like, <laughs> before they were married, it'd be like ask, asking for a meeting with her, and then you saying, yeah, but Max can't come before they were married. Yeah. Like, you would assume that she's just gonna go back and tell Max anyway. Well, if it's, I don't know, then it could be something else. I don't know. I mean, realistically, wouldn't I be trusted by you to keep that between those anyway? Yes. And I, when I've not told you something, I just told you not to tell somebody. But you shouldn't just assume that. that that's not fair. No, but...
I don't know. I'll let you know. If you want to know. I don't I don't care. This is weird. Well, okay, then what do you want me to do? I don't know, Michael. Like that, that, that this is the thing. Like I'm I'm cool with it. Like this is my point. I do something to be cool with it, to try and involve to get into your world, and then shit like this happens and I'm like Well, I wasn't the one that said it. Right, but I'm it it I do, yeah, but like, okay, I'll put it this way. I'm not the one making it awkward this time. No, no, no. I, I'm not saying right. you are. Right, but I'm the one it's going to be held against. So this how, is bullshit and it's the same thing. How, 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 I, how, I don't care. I'm tired. How, I don't how, care. Just how, go to your duty how meeting. How is it it's, being held yeah. against you? I'm not going I, I'm to the asking, meeting. I'm asking, what? I'm not going to the meeting. I'm going to go drive up uh, to the house. Yeah, but this is out of my hands, though. I asked. She said yes, and now she changed her mind. This is, uh, this is cool. not... Yeah. Right. Okay, cool. So don't fucking ask me to get over something when that's what I'm getting. Okay. Sorry. But again, it doesn't fucking matter because it, it doesn't fucking matter when it comes to me, does it? I am literally asking for your opinion on what to do, but you say you don't know. So I don't know what I to do. I don't know what to do. I'm... Then what do you want me to do? That, if you, you can't just... You can't just say that it doesn't matter about your opinion. When, when I'm asking your opinion... <laughs> Jenny, this is not fair. I'm it's asking you... It's not fair you... me, dude. It's not fair me either. I don't want to tell you. Well, I, I didn't do this, so you can't put the blame on me. Like, I'm I'm going to a meeting. I asked if you could come. She said yes. She changed her mind. Like, it's out of my hand. You're not point. concerned about the fact that she changed her mind? Okay, should I just not go to the meeting? No, that's... Okay, then you go to that extreme. You know what? You just make me feel like a dick. Go away. Okay, I, I give up, man. I can't. How? I don't know. Do not know. Do not know. I, again, I do I I don't follow like what what was incorrect about this You bait me You bait me You oh hey well, Hello. Still accept your hug oh, uh, 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 Accept your hug Oh hi, hi. Little... Hey You met Berg before right He is a uh, he was on the list This is just Anisberg Anderson's Bergen Just Anders Berg Anderson. yeah No I've not met him before Oh, okay, well, he's uh, one of the new DOC guards that was on the list today. Hello. Yes, I do remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Berg is um, one of my... Um... Top dogs. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He does, uh, he does a little private investigating for me, or, or has uh, in, in the past uh, last mm. um, few months. But um, he's, been, um, he's been very helpful. Yeah, I have tracked... I, I don't even know the biggest things that I've done. I can't th I can't remember. Yeah, you helped track life. down uh, those people who kept attacking senior bonds for the ego act. You helped figure oh, yeah. that out. You and Greg, you guys did good work. <laughs> that was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. This is Berg's new DOC uniform. Isn't it cool? It's kind of uh, stained. I have questions, yeah. What are your questions? Not about the <laughs> uniform. <laughs> oh lord. What, what what are they for? <coughs> uh, you don't have to smoke just to seem cool. You you, uh, it's... No, I I've done it before. I'm good at it. <laughs> uh, you sound like you're about to have an asthma attack, Barry. Do you have an inhaler? No. Yeah, no, no, you're good. I see, I got this. I'm not exhaling, I'm not a pussy. No, no, you, you gotta exhale, Bark. I already inhaled. 
and then you okay did you did you okay. swallow it yeah did you sw oh god oh my god um you're gonna burp up smoke later. No, he's gonna throw up. Or, is, or you're gonna puke from nicotine poisoning. <laughs> yeah. No, thank you, you. Yeah, no, you're you're going to. You sm You swallowed it. You're literally gonna get nicotine poisoning now. The hospital is over there. Just uh, yeah. When you start feeling it. You start to feel nauseated. Head over that way. Okay. I don't know if charcoal's gonna work for him. Like normally they give you charcoal when you're having like whatever, but like if it's smoke, yeah, I'm like. But that's only if you like ingest something that can get. Yeah. I mean, it's sort of ingested in a manner of speaking, but I don't think it's going to be active. I don't think the charcoal is going to absorb the nicotine smoke. Mm -hmm. Anyway, what did you want to talk about? I, I feel like I'm... Do you need me to walk off? Oh, no, no, you're fine, Berg. We're actually going to go... Uh, we're going to go for a ride. Okay. Real fast, but... um, Love you. I'm super proud of you. And, Thank you. Um, I know that you're going to be great as DOC. Thank you. I'm going to try to keep everyone in line, and that includes my superiors. That's right. You tell them, and you don't let them say any treasonous That's shit right. about Max. You know, whenever we, you know, we did a, a, a big meeting yesterday, and no one, would, no one would stay on tasks, and I had to get up there and yell at everyone. We were listing off all our future employees, and I, I think Bobby kept writing the name LeBron James on the board like 50 times. Oh, my God, Bobby. Yeah. And, Who do you prefer? Who's you your right favorite now, boss, Bobby or Carmine? I don't know. It's kind of a tie. See, Bobby lets me do more to the prisoners, but but Carmine lets me, Carmine, Carmine lets me really spread my wings. All right. Um. I think we have a guy in there who wants to experiment on people. Who? I'm gonna tell you. What if I pay you? Well, yeah. I don't know his name. I just what know if, what he looks like. What if you get his name and we pay you? Okay. All right. I can figure it out. Well, you're a private investigator, right? Well, yeah. Oh, good job. I mean, I, I, that, that's also why I got this job. I figured I could, like, <laughs> multitask, you know? Just think about how easy it'd be, you know, if I'm in the prison. Mm-hmm. Well, there you go. Yeah. Anyway, you guys, you guys get uh, on your. <laughs> Berg, stop smoking to seem cool. Just no, go. I'm, I'm smoking. You don't smoking need to pick up not, this hobby. Smoking is not cool, first of all. It's, it's yeah, what Michael said, it's not cool. It's bad Hello? for you. Hello? Love you, Berg. Hello? I don't have okay, but it looks. It's mm -hmm. kind of cool. <laughs> why did you pick up James smoking? James Dean. Why? Why? Because yeah. you felt socially pressured. What do you mean? Pay your pressured. By who? We were both smoking. We both lit up at the same time next to him. No, I meant you. Why did you pick up smoking? Why did I pick up smoking? I used to be a big smoker. Yeah, but then you went into a social smoker. Honestly, uh, why did I stress? Why was I smoking that cigarette? Oh my god, because uh, Norman and I started. Uh, I actually wrote it up. If you want to look at it, um, well, I didn't write it up. I just stole what he's been working on, and I'm adding some additions. Mm. Uh, scheduled drugs, right? Um, and we started, yeah, like drug scheduling. She knows, um, he, instead he of having like a million fucking that. charges in the penal code for drugs, like actually having like a planned process for mm -hmm. how to schedule drugs. Okay. Um, and we started talking, uh, doing a little reminiscing on the older public about drug court cases and drug trafficking. And right. then we started talking about this one that I fucking hated, nightmare. I hate drug trafficking cases. Oh my god. Mm. They are boring and formulaic, and their defense lawyers always do some weird fucky shit with their arguments, like the prop fucking argument. Oh my god, I've never wanted oh, six and a half hours of bullshit that I had to listen to. And I got so stressed out just talking about it, kind of like I am, kind of feeling blood pressure rising now, that I wanted a cigarette. That's how. <laughs> um, so... That's how that went down. Oh. So before when we last talked about if you would run for mayor again or not, you sounded like you didn't want to. Um, yeah. Can I ask what, I mean, obviously I would love to have you still be in council meetings. Um, it would still kind of be the same thing, I feel like. Right? Like, yeah, so, like we talked about it first, right? I talked mm -hmm. about if I, if I go into it, I would still be doing shit on the side, so the chance of getting impeached would be there. Right. 
so it doesn't really change much. It was like, but it, it it's, I don't, so here's the thing, right? I don't personally think that I would have a chance. I feel like with some of the changes that I've, I've done, people would, people are going to hate my ass. I don't think so. I mean, I, literally, like, Max and I both want you there, you know? Yeah. And I think that, uh, I mean, the number one thing with most voting is name recognition. Yeah, true. You have that. Yeah, but it also kind of depends on who's going to run. I swear to God, if I fucking hit the pedal again and the front lights go out, I will... It does depend. It does depend on who's going to run. Yeah. I swear to God. This car is fucking cursed. I... I... Yeah, what was that? What? You want to see? You want to see how fucking cursed this thing is? Yeah, let me, let me see. Where is it? What is it? Is it the lights? The headlights? Okay, the headlights and the front window are out, right? I'm going to just... I don't even have... Like, I don't... My like, toolbox is not working. I believe in you. You figured out. Oh, no. No, we need to get another one. But, like, you literally just started driving and immediately just... Mm, this thing is fucking cursed. Oh, my God. I think Vinkle is hiding in there somewhere. Vingle? The Vingle spirit is... The spirit's possessing the car and causing yeah. problems? Yeah. That's, uh, you know, that's, that's entirely possible. Um... Well, uh... I don't know. I, it was just a thought. Like, I'm, I don't know. Because, again... I, uh, you, you know I want it. I, I, when I was asking you before, it's because I wanted you to. Max and I both want you to. To run again? Yeah. <sighs> I want to run again, but I also don't. So here's the, like the way it is right now, right? Uh, I like I, I it. Would, yes. Okay. Here in the corner, though, but I also palace. feel like I'm kind of just like Max said in a writer's drought. Writer's is that block? what you call it? Writer's block. Yeah. Writer's block. So I don't know if I went into like another term of like three months of this, like what what would I do? Oh, that's not what I need to. I mean, yeah, that's true. It's like, what, what? I mean, I know the the scheduled drug things is something that like I've always wanted, hmm. always, forever. The other thing I've always wanted is um more stuff on the books regarding to financial crime. Yeah, no, I can see that. That one, that one, I feel like you can flush out of a ton. Totally, oh, one hundred percent. I just don't see myself doing another three months of this without doing stuff on the side as well. There's no way it's gonna break again, right? All right, oh, fine. No, yeah, going backwards. Let's give it. Uh, what the fuck? This thing is okay. Fucking... All right, that's fucked. <sighs> like, with the the momentum from moving forward shattered the headlight glass? Yeah, I guess I'm not a professional. What so. the fuck? That's not... What the fuck? Um, I'm gonna just say that, uh, you know, Max and I have the same plan, possibly, as you. Um, okay. For next time, anyway. But they might start branching out doing a little, uh... You know, a little, uh... Dabble. Some side <laughs> endeavors. Dabbling into the criminal underworld. Yeah. Well, Max already yeah, has like I'm assuming Max has a lot of contacts as it, as it is, and then you by proxy would you would be able to too. But are you are you ready to leave that life behind too? Um, I'm trying to figure out who I am away from the Department of Justice because it's been mm. a part of my identity for such a long time. Um, and I. Part of me is scared to leave that behind. Um, and then another part of me is excited at the possibility of... Something new. Um, new things in the future. Right. So uh, I, I, I'm torn, but I'm also... I also think I'm ready. I have paid my fucking dues. I have yeah. done the work. For mm. a long time. And you also have to 
keep in mind that if we both do run, and if either of us do win, then proceed to go down that path, you get caught doing it, get impeached, you're removed from the position and you're not allowed to do it again for how many nine months? months? Was it nine months nine. we agreed on? Yeah. Nine is what we agreed on, yeah. Yeah. So if you're fine with... But again, you can be judge, I guess. Uh, I guess you could get an expungement unless you do something I could just get an crazy. expungement. That's it. All, that's all I need. I would just need an expungement if I, the day ever came that I wanted to go back into my judge life. Yeah. Um, But, uh... I mean, I've been saying this, like... If I won... I would I would want Max as my chief of staff. But what if you won? Would you have Max as your chief of staff too? Mm. You know, keep the keep us three, keep that run back going. No, I, I'm, salty run back is the wrong term, but you know what I'm saying. Like we could, you know, run it back us three. Maybe yeah, if that's the best way to do it. I don't know. I, I I didn't really think about anything honestly because my first thing was like, hey, I I kind of want to run just for shits and giggles, but I don't think I'm gonna win. And then I didn't really think past that. <laughs> I mean, uh, it, it is a possibility that I think you should consider. I mean, I I I I do think I'll get a fair amount of votes, and I do hope to win. But uh, I also, you know, wouldn't be entirely opposed you know what i mean like i wouldn't be mad if you won and we still did the same you know us three back in the council running that show you know when it comes to our uh voting block hmm. yeah well i'm assuming if oh so okay let's uh hypothetically or whatever you is that how you use it i guess it is yeah that is yeah so say so we both run uh okay you become mayor. Okay. And I don't become anything. Are you choosing Max in that case, or are you choosing me? Like, I, I think we talked about that, like, kind of... ish. Or are you choosing oh. Max until, until he doesn't show up for, for his position gets removed? You know it's an you... appointed position, and, you know, that's, Michael, that's a very real possibility. <laughs> uh, what you just said there, the latter mm -hmm. one is... Probably, I want to be honest and transparent with you. Probably the most likely uh, scenario that I could foresee happening is, uh, yeah, uh, you know, I I would, I my ideal world is us, us three again. Hmm. But if you for some reason were not, I don't even want to think about you not being in there. Like, oh, uh, okay. Well, we don't uh, have to think. Like, I, again, I I don't. It, I it mean, was just. I, a question like I don't I don't feel like you shouldn't choose Max right he, as my husband he's my first pick but yeah. like you are literally literally second pick for the role okay and that that makes sense I guess like I'm not it, it was again just it's gotta just be somebody that I can trust yeah right who we seem to be like in alignment with I agree uh, and finding like-minded people like <laughs> that who actually know Los Santos well enough to make educated decisions and also understand Is this not the sipping on different oligarchy? departments. To, it's, it's a fucking tall fucking order. Yeah. Have the knowledge and the ability and then also see things in the same light. Mm, I, I agree. I'm surprised at how like-minded we are across the board as well and in the things that Obviously, there's a few outliers in terms of, like, what we agree and disagree on, but yeah. I feel like generally across the board, we kind of We're agree with most things. Yeah. Yeah. I think we've been around the city long no, enough to... No, this is Patrick. ...to know how things are and also to see how things could be. Yeah. I always said that there's, like, a divide between people who see the city how it is and see how this and the people who see the city for what it could be. Yeah. And like know. those are like the two schools of thought within Los Santos. There are people who are like, this is how it's always been, and this is how I always want it to be. And there are people who are like, but we could actually, pretty much conservatives versus liberals, right? People want to conserve and preserve the status quo versus people are willing to show you things a new way. People need to fucking move on. This is not five years ago or more. Like things change and they should change. Yup, they should. It's the healthy. Ways, we're just gonna run it back into the ground.
I'm curious about who else is going to run, to be honest with you, right now. I know one. Who? Party Hardy. <laughs> oh, Party Hardy's going to run? Does he, doesn't he run every time? Yeah, I think Isn't he does run every time. Like, his shtick That's his is whole just shtick, running? yeah. <laughs> yeah, other than that, I don't know. I don't know who would actually run for mayor. I don't feel like I've heard anyone be genuinely interested in that position. Same. And it's not like we're that far away. I feel like voting and everything should be soon, right? Uh, like three or so weeks. Is that when the new ones are selected or elected? Uh, the three, okay, three weeks time is when uh, applications, okay, and like two and a half weeks time is when applications should go up. Three weeks time should be when voting opens and four weeks time should be when the new mayor, uh, when the uh, transition of power occurs. Mm. Oh, um, Party Hardy actually said he would endorse me. He wouldn't, uh, he would endorse you. It, so. Yeah, he would endorse me. He said he wouldn't run and he would endorse me, um, if we get some funding for some, like, Wu Chang events, like Wu Chang Wednesdays, where they have a co cool concert down in the Groves, on Grove Street. It was a really good concert this last week. And you know it's a good, you know it's a good concert, all right? You know it's a good party, all right? When the cops show up to say they got noise complaints. Huh. Got, somebody, what was it? Cordwood showed up and he's like, this man got some noise complaints, okay, right? People's kids got school tomorrow. Mm, either, either it's because it's a very good party or there's a Karen. That just um, I think it was a bit of both. Yeah. I think it was a bit of both. Uh, Cordwood said it was Rami who called. <laughs> Rami who called? Uh, yeah. I guess that he's a Karen. Yeah, that's why I said it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a bit of both. Where was this part? Where was the party at? It was, uh, it was, um, at the cul-de-sac on Grove Street. Just like a, like a bulk uh, party. Oh, they live there, don't they? Uh-huh. Oh, I don't know. Well, you should know what he signed up for, living in the fucking cul-de-sac. Exactly. Also, this thing is so quick now, but battery overheats in, like, seconds. Um... Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, it, it super overheats. Um... I do have a question, though. Um, mm. If you did win mayor, would you choose Max for chief of staff over someone else like, say, Jenny? Mm. Would I choose Jenny over Max? Yeah. Hmm. That's a Who good would you question. choose as your chief of staff? I, okay, so here is me being honest. I would probably choose Jenny because I feel like, again, we, we kind of rotate back to would, would Max show up? Is he is he signing up for another three months? Would he be willing to do that? I mean, he said that he would for me. He said he would commit and do it. Okay. Uh, this battery's about to fucking explode. Uh, I don't know. I I kind of want Jenny to, but I don't know if Jenny. I so I asked her earlier about this as well. Okay. So her her reaction to this is that she doesn't think that I have it in me to go for three months and not commit to the three months. And I don't think that's the case because I, when we talked about this like a week ago, when we just, you know, kind of glossed over it, I said the same thing to you, right? Like that mm -hmm. I was I was planning to do stuff on the side and then if things happen, things happen. No, you did, you did say that. Yeah, so I don't feel like my intentions are changing in that regard. Uh, because right now, like, again, I'm committed to do these three months, and I've been staying clean, other than, you know, speeding like a fucking maniac. The butt out of hell, yeah. Yeah. But other than that, I haven't really done anything that could get me in, in hot waters whatsoever. So. Mm. Yeah, I mean, all I did was a little speed in two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you also got caught doing it. Oh, I made a mistake. I learned my lesson, Michael. I'll always run from the cops, and I will not be honest. I'll just be quiet. Yeah. <laughs> That's what Alan said when I told him and he looked and just, it up in uh, the incident report. He was like, I was like, I didn't want to lie. And he's like, don't say nothing. I'm like, that's a fair point that I could should have, should have, could have considered. It works sometimes. It kind of depends on what situation you're in. If you're, if you're leany or like if you work with the cops rather than being a Karen, then sometimes they will get you out of it. But I guess then you have weep one and two. Uh, who doesn't care? 
But I guess that, you know, he's being, one is being the protagonist, the other is being Ockley. I can uh, say that. Yeah, no, one of them is, um, you can't say that, yeah, that no, yeah, main character or whatever. Mm -hmm. Uh, what do weebs hate? What can I do to punish them? What do weebs hate? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, mm, if you say that their favorite anime, anime is bad, they will go on a tantrum. Okay. All right. That's all it takes. <laughs> or, uh, I don't know. It kind of depends on what they're into. Oh, well, I'll say based on the smell, I think they hate showers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Uh, if you say your fa favorite anime is fucking Sword Art Online, they maybe might, maybe they'll lose their shit or they agree with what you. What if I said I, my favorite anime was Pokemon? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think that works. Wait, I thought that would piss them off. No. It's still... Okay, what if I said my favorite anime was, um... Fuck. Uh, The Little Mermaid. Yeah, I'll say it was a Disney princess yeah, movie. Yeah, that could work. Right? Will that work? Yeah. Tell them my favorite anime is, is The Little Mermaid. Yeah. Because then the thing you're... Yeah, no, I could see that one, kind of. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just trying to think about... You know, they ask me a question, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fuck with him. I feel like I should get to fuck with him. Yeah. Like, it could work. Uh, oh, it yeah, you know depends. what? Weebs hate when you call anime cartoons. That's because they're dumb. Because in theory, they are cartoons. They're animated, aren't they? Yeah, they're animated. Doesn't two, like, a cartoon just describe that it's a... Uh... It's a drawn character. Isn't it like a blanket statement, kind of? Yeah, I, I mean, I don't say so. I mean, if you're talking about, like, filmmaking in particular, like, that's how they started, right? Yeah, and I think anime is just a style. Um, I feel like I just had this conversation with someone. Um, it is just a style. But it's also, for, like, specific from a specific region, right? It's supposed to be, like, Japanese-style animation, and, like, there's a difference between um, anime-inspired cartoons versus like true anime or something um yeah max said that killing declan i get that little shit mm -hmm. Ooh, i hate him he went so hard on me in court max said killing declan is a bad idea do you agree killing him would be a bad idea why uh well no I, that was a that meant that's a question uh, oh yeah i don't know do you think he deserved to get killed uh, I don't know. Tell me what happens when the main character dies. Oh, hmm. I don't think that really happens. Usually when the main character dies, they either resurrect in a different world or they come back and they try to get revenge on the person that killed them. And they get stronger. Yeah, season one was good. Past that, it was an ass. It's like some Star Wars shit. Yeah, if you strike me down, I shall only return more powerful than you can possibly imagine. Mm -hmm. I don't think that's really any winning. Usually they only really die if it's the end of the season. If you do it in the middle of it, there's usually a reason for them to come back. Um, I like the idea of the, the first thing you said, where they're like reborn. In and a new body. World? Yeah, in a different world. Yeah. That's not the highest likelihood. Hmm. They get reborn in a different world where they're, again, the protagonist, but they're just stronger. <laughs> I, I just, I just, what, he was such a little brat. <laughs> was he? In court and in the cells, uh, and my lawyer said he wasn't budging at all on trying to negotiate for a plea deal. But were your lawyers um, also trash? I mean, I went through four of them. Were they all trash? Um, pretty much, except for Sebastian fun fucking saved himself at the very fucking end. Alright? Uh, by, by offering the fucking... But your honor, please don't give her a felony and ruin her entire career. Here's the fucking... We, we offer a deal where we can take her driver's license and whatever. And then the... Uh, uh, <clears throat> Sensei Hook 
said uh, to accept the deal. He actually spoke real quick. Um, to accept the deal uh, with the addition of making me Mormon. Hmm. And then Declan was all like, you honor me, lady son. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I'm literally at the uh, halfway point right now. This is 15 days, 15 more to go. I am struggling. Oh, you at the halfway point now? Yup. Yup. Soon, TM, you'll be there. You'll get it done. Yeah, um, I think I still have to pass my fucking driving test with money. God. I just think it's really stupid to give somebody a driving lesson with a test or whatever, all right? But uh, they're not allowed to practice. For most people with permits have the opportunity to practice driving. Yeah, they usually go out with a... Wait, do you have to pass this test or do you just have to... Oh, no, that's... I don't know. I'm under the impression that I have to pass it or uh, they're going to say that I failed. Hi. My court order thing. Hmm. Might need to get clarification on that one. Because usually if they take your license away, you just get it back after a month when the points fall off. But I don't... I uh, on points. Yeah, that's they the thing. They just took it. Yeah. And I have to get it back. Um, but did it say in the thing anywhere? And they're all out here selling fucking weed. Did it say anywhere? Uh, no, because it's like a bench trial, so I don't have anything written down. I should have written something down. I can clarify yeah. with my lawyer. Oh, Sebastian, he's probably paying more attention than me. Um, but also, since it's not written down, maybe we c I can configure that in my favor. If it doesn't, if they don't have it written down anywhere either, then yes, I'd say so. All right, a little, little, little verbal jujitsu, ju ju verbal mm -hmm. jujitsu, verbal jujitsu, whatever the word is. Um, uh, we, I need to, what we need to do is we need to figure out who the other people running for mayor are, mm -hmm. right? And, um. Kill him. I was going to ask, why don't we ruin <laughs> their, their chances? We could. Would you be down? Yeah, I'm down. I'm down. I think both. I think we all have contacts that could help us out. We absolutely do. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So, all right. Well, I'm down. Same. Man, I used to have serial killers on speed dial unlock to go do things. I know everybody hates them, but they were very useful tools to have in one's arsenal. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they are. Most of the time. So, yeah. Except when they started forming like a weird wolf pack. They're supposed to be lone. They're supposed to be like lone wolves. They should not be in a pack. And they certainly should not form an unholy union with that fucking terrorist organization. That was the worst. What? What? Which there was a time was in the Old Republic when a bunch of serial killers decided, instead of being lone wolves, that they were going to band together and that they would enter an alliance with a terrorist organization. And like those two, those two things should not mix. I don't have anything against terrorist organizations. So don't get me wrong. You know. Oh, yeah, you good. That just uh, why uh, would <clears throat> why would serial killers go into a terrorist organization though? Why would a serial killer join a terrorist organization? Yeah. Um. If their goals aligned, I suppose, or if they had the chance to do some extra killing for the tires. Mm. Mm, I guess. I'm not keeping you up, by the way. Are you trying to sleep? No, you're good. Okay, I just want to make sure. No, I was going to have the meeting with you and whatnot and then and probably head off. So when you no, say head off? There's no rush. Okay, just want to make sure. Yeah, no, you're good. And I remember you said you don't like to drive around. This is my ADHD, so. Ooh! Thoughtful of you. Yeah, it only took me what twenty minutes to realize. That's okay. I just get car sick sometimes. <clears throat> it generally happens when somebody's driving a super cool fast car, zoomy zoomy around. All right, cigarette time. Social smoker. <laughs> I hate her. Oh, I love lights on water. It's so pretty. Uh, we don't have to kill people per se. We we could just, just try to set them up. We could just uh, oh. yeah, we disappear or just set them up with a felony. Or that yeah, no, that works too. Just plant a gun on them. Mhm. Mm um. Wait, did you see my picture of the new car we got? Uh, did you send that? I did. I texted it to you. Uh, 
Oh. 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 Wait, did you buy that used? No, it was available. We got it brand new. It was it's like it was like two hundred and seventy thousand. It was two hundred and seventy thousand dollars. Which one was that? Was that the one you wanted? Yeah, that's the one I was saying, talking to you about, uh, telling you about before the uh, carbonizer. Yeah. Was this the it's one we looked at? It's a convertible, hard top convertible too. Top stop in this. Oh, I think I took it for a test drive. It it sounds like it's a convertible, but it doesn't. Convert. No, it is a convertible, and it does convert. The does top it? goes down. Oh. Yeah, I know. It's both having the wind in my hair. Uh, I think I topped out around like 220, 225, somewhere around there. Not bad. 220. Let's say that's mine. Mine. I hate mine. My car is not the same. Oh yeah, well, I wanted to ask you what's happened to your car now. It's fucking awful. That's what happened. I don't want to talk about it. It makes me sad. Does it not handle the same anymore? No, it's fucking horrendous. No! Oh, that makes me sad, Michael. Your car handled so great. Oh my god. Yeah, it's not fun to drive anymore. It'd be so sad for you. Damn. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Where did Max park this too? I can't even. He put it in the regular parking. Uh, so I can't pull it out so you could see it. Kind of disappointed. Wait, I can't say that. That doesn't sound like a joke. Ugh. We uh, immediately put the 99 turbo in it too, so. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Like, I don't. The 99s are. What? What are you gonna say? I have an 88 on purpose. Why? Do you tell? Uh, so with the 99. It would be less slippery, so it okay. wouldn't it wouldn't wheel spin as much. And I didn't find that fun. It was fun the way it was. Now it's just bad. Mm. Oh, so like you, was it easy to drift then, or? Yes. Ah, okay. Ninety nine didn't do the same thing. And with, and, yeah. and with no turbo at all, it was just ass. Man, I... I am so sorry that that happened to you. Yeah. Glorion thought he was the only one affected negatively, and no. he's wrong. No. No, I think Glorion... Oh, wait, was... how was your date with Glorion, by the way? Uh, he forgot, me to t he forgot to tell me what time it was, so I slept in, and then he was like, yeah, we're already there. It's like, okay, what? that's... <laughs> what? What is... It? What? <laughs> Yeah, no date. Motherfucker didn't send a time, so I was just kind of waiting around. That's fucking rude. <laughs> I'm not too fussed about it. I mean, are you going to try to go on another date with him? Because I'd kind of feel like, yeah, I don't know. That's the plan. Are you going to rain check that? <laughs> yes. Yes, I'm just going to say, I got stood up on a date one time, and I definitely did not date that guy again. No second chances. <sighs> it's fine. I'm on the first date, anyway. Like, that's your chance to make a good impression. What are you, and you're going to... Well, I know Glorion Don't even send already. a time? That's true. Yeah, I know he's he's forgetful. You know, he, he's he's been dabbling in meth. I think his brain is probably semi-rotten, and now he's in the sewers. Mm. Yeah. I think it's his... Yeah. So how did that, uh, how did your guys' little date come about? <laughs> uh, he was just talking about pasta, and I was like, yeah, should we go on a date? And he was like, yep, all right. <laughs> Easy. So he just asked you out, and you were like, yeah? No, I asked him. Wait, you asked him? Okay, yep. hold on, you asked him? Yep. <laughs> how did he catch your eye? <laughs> Siobhan, please. Uh, I don't know, he was just kind of there. I'm sorry, what, you said he was just kind of there? Yeah, he was just kind of there. Would you have dated anybody who was standing there right then? Or, I mean, I just... I find it, I'm 
It may be. I was in the mood, you know. Just the first thing that kind of showed up. Wait, that's uh, not true. Wait, hold on, hold on. Yeah, when, there we go. Go this? ahead, think about it. When was this? When when did? Uh, was that when we uh, we were all talking for like an hour yeah. or two? Oh. Yeah. Huh. Well, he's the only one that's probably single. I think. You're taken. GG is taken. He's the only one that's by himself. <laughs> so is it a lonely thing then? <laughs> no, I no. No, I got tons of friends. I'm never lonely. What what about well, I mean, what about what about Jenny? We're hanging out all the time. Yeah, but like, why not? Why not date her? Oh, it wasn't that kind of date. No, oh. no, 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 no. Oh, no, no. I was so confused. <laughs> no, why was it was... Be, then why would being taken matter? Huh? What kind of date was it? No, I'm just, I'm just kind of fucking with you. Oh my god, you are fucking with me so hard. <laughs> Snappy, I'm trying to actually to understand what the fuck you're saying, and you're just trolling me. Yeah, a little bit. No, a it was more. Of a, yeah, it was more of a friend date. Okay. Snappy, right. thank you so much for the five. No, I don't. <sighs> I think right now. I don't know. I'm not looking for something specific. If something shows up, sure. But I think right now is just. Focusing on getting back on my feet and doing mayor shit. You know what's funny is people dress up as me and go out and fucking just talk to people. Wait, what? People go and talk? Like, are they impersonating you? They're impersonating me and then, and then inviting people out and then giving them my number. Oh my god. And apparently it's working. That's actually hilarious. Oh my god. Ugh. I don't know. I, people say that they just by dressing up is enough. Does, that doesn't work, does it? Surely, surely you have to strike up a conversation. You just have you. You can't just be a looker. Um. Oh right! I Didn't I Billy mean, get a girlfriend? Sure, you can. And what, what if he's an uh, asshole? Then what? I'm just gonna say I would say that probably, um, probably at least half the um, dates I have been asked on in the city were by guys that I had not had a single interaction with prior to them asking me out. <laughs> oh god. Oh. Wait. So you just you huh? You didn't have an interaction with? You just went on a date? Like, the, like no, I didn't date? go on a date with them. The first thing that they walked up to me and <laughs> said is, "Hey, you want a date?" And it's uh. like, no. I don't even know your name, you fuck. Oh, so you didn't go on a date, alright. No, I'm just saying that half the dates I've been asked on, I didn't go on them, but half the dates I've been asked on were by people that I didn't even have a conversation with. They were just like, damn redhead, let me take you out. I was gonna say, does that work? That, no, that does not work. <laughs> well, apparently one one guy dressed up as me and got a girlfriend dressed up as me. Wait, a girlfriend also? Mm -hmm. Oh no, he got a girlfriend while dressed up as you? Oh yes. my god. And then I think it kind of went south, and he tried to get rid of her. Uh... <laughs> yeah. It's a- I feel like it's a joke taken a bit too far. Yeah, that does sound like it's been taken a bit too far. That's kind of impersonating me. Yeah. I remember who it was, the person uh, that worked at fucking PD. I mean, if they're defaming your character in that way, you could definitely sue Michael. Oh, no, I don't care. I'm just throwing the night there. Yeah, no. Like, if they start making you look bad, that's an option. <laughs> they're dressing up as me and then doing fucking crime as well. Which I'm fine with, because I'm just waiting for a cop to be like, I saw you at this incident, and I'm, 